Good morning. Novak Djokovic is playing the final today in the US Open. There are different reactions to this, I noticed. My reaction is, great, this 36-year-old pure blood, I hope he will win. He said no to titles and money to remain a pure blood. And then there are others who say, I hope he will lose. He's a jerk. No. They attack him. It's peculiar, isn't it? I think it's an emotional thing. These people are not interested in the truth about the needle. They want to be right about their decision. Well, it's so impossible to be right if you don't know the truth. You have to find out the truth first. Then you can be right. No, they attack him. No, this top athlete who wants to know what goes in his body. These people attack him, and I suppose, I can imagine, they could walk into a restaurant and they say, uh, what oil are you using here? Is this a clean kitchen? You know, my mother is allergic to a lot of things. How did you prepare that duck? <laughs> See? And they attack this guy. It's ridiculous. No, they are not interested in the truth. It's an emotional thing. I, I believe so, actually. No, I think there is a dividing line in our societies. And it's the truth line. You, know, you can have all the people of Earth standing on the field and you draw a line. And you say, those of you who are interested in the truth, you move over to this side. And those who are not, you go to that side. And you, so you have these two groups. And a peculiar thing is, they are actually starting to kill off the people who are not interested in the truth. I don't think they understood this, you see. Those who are interested in the truth, uh, well, we are like children when it comes to the truth, aren't we? When they came with this stuff, late 2020, we said, all right, so what's going to happen when you put this stuff into people's bodies? What's going to happen to them? We want to know this. Very interesting stuff. The truth. <laughs> the other ones, they, are, they were not interested. So <laughs> it's like you have these two groups now. And those who are not interested, they are starting to die. You know? Isn't that weird? No, I don't think they understood this, you know, these people who are doing this. They thought they would kill everybody. You know? Maybe. So maybe they don't understand this concept, the truth. They understand control and making money. Somebody comes along. What about the truth? You know, and they would say, what are you talking about, the truth? We are controlling stuff here. You know, we are making money now. What is this thing, the truth? We are not interested in this. So maybe they don't understand this concept, you know. So they, they don't realize that there are some people who are interested in the truth and that when they do this experiment, they, these people would do well. They didn't get it. You know? But this is actually what's going on. These people who are not interested, they are starting to die. No, there was a point when I was really worried. It was early on, when the information started to come out about the needle and the result, I thought, wow. A lot of people will die. Maybe billions will die. Um, within months. I was really worried at one point. What's going to happen? Now it didn't happen. Right? But we don't know yet, do we? They keep going with this technology, right? It's in the next one too. So we don't know really. Some people say this winter will be very bad. 
people with this very poor immune system. You know. And I believe it. You know, it's going to be bad, I think. Right. Yeah, it's an emotional thing. You know, I noticed something with myself this morning. I, I was watching this ad for a food supplement. Right? And they said, this is tested and safe. And I became suspicious. You know, I, don't, I don't think I want this. You know. So there was some sort of a reaction in myself. No, this is the language of the authorities, isn't it? Why are you saying that it's tested and safe? <laughs> right. Okay. Be good.